hi guys welcome back to my channel welcome back to another vlog i thought i would vlog my weekend for you guys so the other day i did pick up a camera that i'm super super excited about i'll show you guys more about it later when i get home because i'm about to leave right now i just did my makeup as you guys saw but I am so excited to create better quality videos. I've been filming on my iPhone camera for the longest time, so it's definitely time for an upgrade. Super, super excited. It's a Sony camera, so hopefully you guys will see an upgrade to the video resolution and the audio quality as well. Filming on your iPhone camera is definitely really, really good. Cameras these days on your phone is so good. But um, I just thought it was finally time to switch to a nice real camera. I'm super excited for this new little chapter um, in my channel. So yeah, so right now I'm filming on my iPhone. So the next clip you guys will see will be on my camera. And I'll show you guys what camera I got later and all that fun stuff like this afternoon. But um, for now, I just wanted to give that little update. I'm gonna give you guys a quick OTD of what I'm wearing today. Just a nice, simple little outfit. It's gloomy and it's a little rainy out. Black plain long sleeve shirt from Brandy, I believe. And this nice long Zara coat um, that I got the other week that I put in a little shopping haul that I'll link down below if you guys haven't seen. And then I'm wearing these blue jeans that are pretty old that are from PacSun that I love so much but yeah hi guys I just got out of the nail salon hopefully if you guys can tell I am on my new camera that I'm filming on so the quality should be so much better the audio all that stuff obviously I'm still experimenting and having fun with it and learning as I go but yeah, I'm on the new Sony camera right now, so I'm super, super excited. I hope it looks really good. I can't wait to watch back the footage and see, but I'm still getting used to it and all that fun stuff. But yeah, I just got out of the nail salon. I'll show you guys my nails real quick. Um, this is what they look like. I'm trying to get them to focus. There you go. So I just got my normal, usual shape, um, and this time I did Funny Bunny. So OPI Funny Bunny and two coats of it. I am a simple nail person when it comes to nails. I don't do anything crazy. So yeah, I can't believe I'm using my new camera right now. And obviously, when I do vlogs and stuff, sometimes when I'm out, I am going to use my phone just because sometimes it is a little awkward to pull out a big camera in public. And some places don't even allow like filming in stores and restaurants and stuff like that. So, but for all my sit-down videos and as much as I can, I'm obviously going to film with my Sony camera. But just know sometimes if you see discrepancies from here on out, um, I'm in public and I don't want to pull out this big camera. I am so, so excited and so happy. So far, it's looking really good. I'm still experimenting with it. And I'll show you guys what camera I got and all that stuff, like I said, later on when I get home. But I think right now we're going to get some lunch um, and see where the day takes us. But just wanted to update you guys. Wanted to give you another close up of my nails. Super, super natural. I love Funny Bunny and I love mixing like OPI's um, neutral nude colors. Just a nice little coffin shape. Let them cut down a little bit shorter because they were getting a little bit long, but just a nice natural nail shape. So, love them. <laughs> Just wanted to update you as you guys saw we had some lunch at cheesecake factory one of my favorite restaurants of all time it was so good we got the chicken chipotle pasta and the louisiana pasta which is always a go-to so i highly recommend those two if you guys like getting pastas and they're super good um one's like a little spicy and they both have chicken in it and some protein those are my absolute favorites from GC factory and then after we walked around at the mall for a little bit and we went to the new Nike store that's built in our mall didn't get anything 
and then um, went to Sephora a little and also didn't really get anything because the VIB sale is coming up next week. So I'll definitely shop that next week and there'll be videos out of a big haul because I've been saving so many things on my little wish list because I know the sale is coming up. So definitely look forward to those videos. Just also went to Starbucks real quick to get a little mid-afternoon pick-me-up. We had a little gift card, so might as well get Starbucks. And yeah, so now I'm back home and I wanted to show you guys the new camera. So this is what the camera is. It's by Sony and it is the ZV-1F camera. So this is the box that it comes in and this is what the camera looks like. And yeah, I just did my research on it and was comparing two cameras. I was comparing this one and then the Canon G7X Mark II. A little bit of a price difference between the two. I think it's around like 200, 250 of a price difference. But I just did my research and I kind of just like the Sony one a little bit better. It also comes with a little microphone, little head thing for the camera which I don't have on just yet, but I will have that on in the future. But yeah, so far I'm liking it so much. I still need to learn how to adjust a couple of settings and like how to transport all the footage onto my laptop. But so far it has been so much better using the camera than my phone. My iPhone camera does have its pros though. Like I said, it's really easy to just whip it out um, really quick when you're outside in public and film some clips. As you saw, some clips were on my iPhone when I was at the mall. But um, overall, just having a camera is so much better. So I'm so happy that I got to invest in a nice camera and produce really good quality videos. This is what the camera looks like. It is so, so weird um, holding up a camera than holding up my phone. So yeah, she looks like this. And it obviously flips this way to the viewfinder so I can see myself when I'm filming myself in front. This is what she looks like. Super, super excited. Highly recommend this camera um, for like a starter camera, vlogging, or really for anything. It's really, really nice so far. So really, really excited. Also wanted to show you guys a PR package that I got from Moroccan Oil. Super, super excited and super grateful that they sent something over. I've actually never tried anything from Moroccan Oil before. I've seen them at Sephora all these years, so I'm super excited to give them a try, and I'll show you guys what is in this package. It says, the future is colorful, and it opens up, and we have some really fun products. We have two of their new items that just came out. This is the Color Care Shampoo, and then the Color Care Conditioner. So, so excited to try these. And then this item, I don't believe is new, um, it is their color care per protect and prevent spray and I'm a sucker for any type of Spray like after the shower for your hair like the spray that protects your hair from heat and damage And just I love a good detangler. So I'm so excited to use this next time I wash my hair and it looks so good and it smells really good as well so i'm so excited to use these in the shower next time yeah, thank you so much moroccan oil for sending this little package over i'm so excited to use these new products also wanted to show you guys a snack that i have been loving these are the aussie bites from costco and they are so good it's like a little healthy little snack in one it has rolled oats apricots flax seeds sunflower seeds honey coconut quinoa chia seeds and more it's a little like granola little bite filled with like nuts and seeds and like little like dried um fruit bits and it's literally so good and it's just a nice little like power snack to have in the afternoon and we just got these like a week ago and we're ready more than halfway through so these are such a nice little snack to bring with you to school or work or anything like that and i love them and i highly recommend them
show you guys a little bit of my morning. I did my skincare, I got ready, I made coffee, got water, did all those little things and cleaned up and spruced up a little bit. And right now I just made a really, really simple and fast breakfast. As you guys saw, I made some scrambled eggs, a piece of toast and some yogurt. And I was gonna put avocado um, on this plate, but our avocados are not ripe yet. We just got them yesterday, so they're super hard. So just a simple breakfast will do. And I actually just got these yesterday at Trader Joe's. They are the organic low fat strawberry squishers. They look like this. And if you guys remember these, from like your childhood, then let me know down below. I think back then they were called Go-Gurts and this just brings me back to my childhood because I had Go-Gurts all the time growing up. My parents used to buy them from Costco in these big boxes and they were like two flavors. I think there was blueberry, strawberry, banana and I remember them even having like SpongeBob SquarePants like themed ones and they'd be like little riddles and little puzzles on them and jokes and stuff on them. So this is just bringing me back down memory lane. All these yesterday, I thought I had to pick them up because I haven't had these obviously in years since my childhood. So I just thought it was a fun little thing to buy. I know these are like mainly for kids and stuff, but who cares? So I'm gonna eat my breakfast and I think I'm gonna end off the vlog here. Hopefully I have enough footage for this little small vlog. Regardless, I hope you guys enjoyed watching this little vlog. Subscribe to my channel if you haven't already. Follow me on Instagram. All my information is always down below and I'll see you guys in the next video. Bye.